Hey guys, big price here. Lost 750 from the Magic Millions of Seamus Award. I think he's a very good stallion, Seamus Award. I went to Mythos last year and had a good look at him at one of those open days, and he's a magnificent, big, strong beast. So I think his horses take a bit of time. And he's one of those stallions. He can get Group 1 winners. A lot of stallions can't, or first season staff, or... But for, look, for a proven stallion, I mean, incentivised was just gun horse, race horse, Due, fantastic. Mr. Quickie, Group 1 mile winner. El Patroness, Group 1 winner. He's had a heap of other... Even Swat's that. Um, you know, I've watched her and she's, she's a brilliant sprinter. I, I just think we're on a very uh, consistent winner-getter, group winner-getter stallion. This filly, I think she'll be 12, 14, 16. I didn't buy her to be a running two-year-old. She'll be in work as a two-year-old, of course, and have trials and do whatever. And if she's going to make a two-year-old, she'll make a two-year-old. But she's medium size. She's beautiful walking filly and beautifully balanced. And I just think they're a breed that grows. So if you picture her as a spring three-year-old and an autumn three-year-old, I think we're going to have a really nice horse. She's lovely and sound and clean and correct and... Beautiful deep girth on her, which is an absolute necessity uh, on the good horses. Big hind quarter. Like I said, not an overly big filly, but just a beautiful, neat, well-balanced filly is probably going to grow and grow. I think once we sort of just give her a little bit of patience, a little bit of time, and just, you know, break her in, spell her, give her a couple of preps, I think she's really going to develop. Uh, but look, the main thing is what you can't grow into them is good movement, and she has beautiful movement. She's a sweet filly. Like I said, beautiful big deep girth on her. I think she's a really good buy, and she's by a good stallion. I mean, you know, she is half to a stakes winner, and she's got stakes winners all through the page, so if we get stakes winner out of her, we're going to have a valuable filly. But um, it is in the context of what they're bringing up here. Uh, I think she's very well bought and she's a gorgeous filly by a proven stallion. Good luck with her.